what I really want people to understand is there's nothing wrong with you. This is a very, very normal, primitive reaction to danger, right? You're designed to stay safe and be alive. And when your system senses danger, either physical danger, you know, a car is changing lanes and doesn't see you, or psychological danger, you turn on the news and see actually just yesterday in Seattle, the, like a pregnant woman got shot at 11 in the afternoon. And my immediate thought is like, oh my God, that's crazy. Like who else can get shot? Does that mean my kids, my surviving daughter is safe walking down the street? You know, you start to catastrophize and go into this place where the world's not safe. And so that is, your nervous system has two gears. You know, I'm, I'm oversimplifying, but basically the I am in danger. I need to allocate resources towards survival gear. That is called the sympathetic branch of your nervous system. And exactly what you were saying happens. It prioritizes survival. So like blood is routed to your arms and legs so you can fight or flee. And it down regulates anything that's not critical to survival. The part of our brain that helps us problem solve our executive function area is known as our prefrontal cortex. It's basically our forehead. So blood flow is not routed there because you can't really contemplate the meaning of the universe when you have to survive. You have to have, make very, very limited fight or flight choices. So if you've ever had that moment, like, you know, I often see my friends, um, you know, uh, like we're at that age when people are getting tested for breast cancer and they'll get the news like you, you don't have cancer, you have pre-cancer, but you have to have surgery tomorrow. <laughs> and to them, it's like, oh, of course, I have to do this right away. And I'm like, take a beat. You, you don't have cancer, you're not dying, you can get a second opinion, but in their mind, like there's no options, it's very black and white. So how do you take a beat? How do you activate that safety gauge, which is the other branch of your autonomic nervous system, your parasympathetic branch, where you can rest, where blood flow is routed back towards digestion, detoxification, where blood flow is routed to your prefrontal cortex, where suddenly you can realize, wait a minute, like, I have choices. And you know, one of those choices is like, I do nothing and I wait until tomorrow. And then, and then you yeah. start calmly listing options. And you know, the opposite, I learned this in therapy, the opposite of I do not feel safe is I have options. Because once you have options, there are all these possibilities. 